Hey, welcome back to Woodruff Woods. It's a uh, cold, dreary, damp day outside. And uh, as you can see, I got the fireplace burning here behind me. Uh, I've mentioned in previous videos, we heat our entire home with this. Uh, it's usually good until you get down into like uh, single digits and then we have to supplement with the electric heat. But uh, uh, this, this works really, really well. It's a Regency. But that's not what I'm here to talk about today. I'm here to talk about uh, something that a company sent me to take a look at that uh, I'm anxious to try out. Uh, I turned down a lot of these opportunities uh, because they're not uh, kind of, you know, in the spirit of the channel. For example, recently I had uh, a company come to me and wanted me to sell jewelry and, and chocolates, uh, just to mention a couple. And uh, I've turned those down. I don't think that's what you all want to see. And uh, frankly, um, you know, it just doesn't fit with what I do. But let's get to unboxing this and I'll show you what I've got. I was contacted by a company uh, that sells on Amazon and they asked me to try out their firewood rack. You can see the name of the company here, Deer, Deer Fammy, I think, or Deer Fammy. I'm not exactly sure how to pronounce it. As you can see, it comes in a nice box. It's quite heavy. Uh, I don't know the exact weight of it. It certainly seems to be uh, a lot of metal in here. Put that aside and uh, got a little bit of dust and debris here on the floor, but that's what happens when you burn wood. So uh, it's just two pieces of metal from what I can see. That is one and this is the other. And from what I understand, this is very easy to put together. You just slide this into these holes and voila, you've got a firewood rack. So I just brought in an armload of wood and put it in the firewood rack. As you can see, uh, it holds quite a bit of wood, and uh, I, you know, it's very sturdy. Uh, the the metal is quite thick. We'll measure it here in a minute. We'll take it up to the garage and get the calipers out, and see what it looks like. You know, I think it's a durable product. It's uh, you know very easy to put together, obviously, and uh, kind of anxious to try this outside. It is indoor and outdoor. It's got a nice powder coat on it. It'll be nice to uh, have this you know where you can just slide it in to the car and uh, you know keep the wood up off the ground so it's not absorbing moisture at the campsite but uh, let's get this up to the garage we'll take a measurement on it and we'll just see uh, what gauge steel they've used for this but uh, as you can see it has no problem holding you know probably I'm gonna say there's probably 30 to 50 pounds of wood in there so being the typical male that I am I didn't read the instructions but frankly it's so simple you don't have to I can show you the directions. It just says to pull the two pieces out. I don't know if I can get close enough here. Slide them in together as I did. And you have a firewood stand. So a very simple design, but obviously very effective. If you go to DeerFamy.com, you can see all of their products. Uh, DeerFamy is a uh, outdoor uh, company. Uh, they're making tents, uh, cots, rocking chairs, um, you know, a camp, different camping chairs and stools, tents, as I mentioned, and, uh, you know, paddle boards, uh, all kinds of stuff for, for going out camping. Also, um, you can find some of their products, if, if not all of them, on Amazon. And uh, if you take a look at Amazon and uh, you type in the search, Dear Famy you will see all of their products pop up. And one of the first ones is our firewood rack here. And if I click on that, uh, in here it does give you the measurements. Uh, it talks a little bit about it being be able to be used indoors and outdoors and just how easily it can be stored. So uh, if I click through the pictures, it will show you just how easy it is to, to assemble versus the competitive products. Uh, it shows you just how much it can hold. It says 55 pound capacity. I, I think it would probably even do more than that. We'll get a measurement on this. Coming up with 0 .1, 0 0.128 uh, inches. 
Actually, I did put this on the bathroom scale. I don't have a really good scale for measuring this, but it was about nine and a half pounds for both pieces. That gives you an idea of just how, how sturdy this thing is built. One of the things I really like about this product is how easy it is to stow. For some people, they don't have a full-size pickup like I do, and they're trying to go camping and pack all their gear into a small car, or maybe a small SUV or something. So space is a, a critical component of, of what you can take along. How much is it going to take up? Well, a lot of our camping stuff takes up a lot of space. You have coolers and maybe totes full of some of your camping gear. Nice thing about this, this firewood rack is it fits right in between. You can stick it right in between, or even better yet, you can just lay it down flat, put your toad on it, and you're ready to go. I'm out here at the backyard fire pit. I brought one of my uh, uh, fire starters, which is waterproof, and today you definitely need that. We saw a break in the rain here, so I thought I'd bring the, the uh, firewood rack out, give you a look at how it is outside. We'll uh, just get this lit here. And I did grab some dry wood out of the woodshed because uh, it, is, it is so wet out here that you wouldn't find a dry piece of wood anywhere. But anyway, we'll get this fire going. Um, maybe get a look at this with, uh, with an actual setting. I mean, I'm staging it, obviously, but uh, this is a typical campsite look. And uh, if you go to state parks or, or campgrounds, uh, this is very similar to what you might find. With the uh, firewood rack, we're keeping everything up off of this really damp ground. And as you can see, it's really starting to light pretty easy. I have to admit, using those fire starters makes it a whole lot easier than trying to wad up some newspaper or get some, some tinder to uh, ignite. So for those of you who watch uh, Stranger Things, I think the uh, sheriff's name on there is Hooper. In the uh, first first few episodes, uh, had a comment that I believe in that mornings are made for coffee and contemplation. So uh, I've got myself a piping hot cup of coffee here. I got my wood here in the uh, Deer Fammy uh, firewood rack. It's keeping it up off the ground, nice and dry. I've been burning little bit of this cherry because it just smells so good so I'm gonna enjoy my fire and do a little coffee contemplation and combustion so that's gonna wrap it up for this episode of Woodruff Woods I thank you for stopping by and uh, we'll catch you on the next one